को दे श्री मणिकम टेगोर थैंक यू सर थैंक यू स्पीकर सर इंडिया इज एन ओल्ड कंट्री बट यंग नेशन एंड लाइक द यंग एवरीवेयर वी आर इम्पेशंट आई एम एन यंग एंड आई टू हैव अ ड्रीम अ ड्रीम ऑफ एन स्ट्रॉन्ग इंडिया independent and self reliant in the front of nations of the world in the service of mankind with the quote of sri rajiv gandhi i like to initiate the debate on the grants and ministry of youth affairs and sports finance minister has plotted 2216 crores for the ministry for this financial year and <coughs> i am reiterate the bjp's new india a trillion dollar dream but a million dollar mindset honorable minister is here and i like to start with the their party vision document in 2014 of the election manifesto in which page number 20 it speaks about the youth making india unstoppable and there are some promises the party has made it for example young leaders program it was this promise to set up a national youth advisory council this promise bjp has promised district level income incubation and accelerator program for in, for encouraging innovation and entrepreneurship it has been promised availing students loan has been promised setting up of neighborhood children and youth parliament across india has been promised a, law, a program for youth for development has been promised but all these promises has been kept as promises only and <coughs> honorable minister on the targets the party which party's policy document which speaks about it where we are where we have arrived where what more needs to be done and the party's document which i see as their government document also i presume that the house at least try to know the deliveries made by the government the return promises by the policy document or else the document of 2014 itself is just a jumla document after that also in bjp sankalp patra in 2019 page number 27 speaks about youth in governance mentions that they there would be incentive reward youth who engage with soci- society but when we see when when i see the grants under the nehru yuva kendra rajiv gandhi national institute of youth development young leaders program i doubt whether government truly wants to walk the talk on its election promise or just simply wants to kill the institutions having the names of certain individuals who build the nation the neighborhood youth neighborhood and the youth leaders award the national youth advisory council that programs encouraging leadership about the youth something on which the prime minister has focused repeatedly on man ki baat has seen zero zero budget allocation the sankalp patra also talks about special awareness and treatment of substance abuse though this is being a predominantly a health issue but it is high time we see abuses beyond the tra- traditional scope substance abuse has become so normal that we started to take it for granted addressing the doping agencies issues the budgetary allocation for anti doping agencies is minimal what we need for this issue is a dedicated awareness campaign advertisement and marketing which the government is an expert is the best is the best alternative to propagate this message against substance abuse against the youth but strikingly the budget has minimum allocation for such informative spending which programs like beti bachao beti padhao has have advertising budget more than the scheme itself but what i want to emphasize is that what we want to we don't want to have a utwa india just like a utwa punjab which was created because of akali and bjp policies in punjab when we speak about youth hostels it should be form of it should form the core 
of the government strategies to boost its sadbhavana scheme for jammu and kashmir students had already seen any capital allocation at times like this when the youth of the especially from the scheduled caste and the scheduled tribe counterparts are traveling across india it is important that government provides suitable accommodation in the hostels it's very heartening to see that out of the 80 hostels in under the youth hotel hostels only 50 are in functional stage itself and i request the honorable minister to stay in one one of the youth hostels to see how its conditions are i hope that he can his stay will improve that youth hostels across india we should have minimum had in each district one youth hostel at least and i like to take taking to sports the primary agenda of the existence of the ministry i have stand by the budgetary allocations made by the ministry ministry in for several federations responsible to look after the sports in india 9 crore rupees allocated for hockey 9.6 crores for national rifle association 1.3 crore rupees to athletics federation of india is this how we are going to attain our dream to be the top table top table of the olympics is this how daughters of our country like hema das piti usha geeta and thousands of girls inspired by this them come out of the shortcomings and try truly shine in the world of and how does how how long does modi ji will hide the rags of rich stories of our hard working sons and daughters and like rathod uh, my colleague rathod also to take the responsibility the disasters of rio olympics we need to have a concrete plan not tweets and challenge videos to make a difference in the field of sports i like to speak about the nehru yuvakendra a pan india organization which has been receiving end of the which is have is at the receiving end of the government's hatred for the nehru institutions beyond the poultry token sum of around 257 crore 39 39 percentage of the sports in the post in the organizations are laying vacant the allocation the in the nyks around 500 officials have retired getting their pension benefits from NY, NY, nyks as as an autonomous body it should have formulate nyks pension trust with a seed money of 20 25 crore for to the needs of the pensioners as followed in other autonomous bodies will the minister take action towards that a budget the a demographic difference of more than 40 percentage of our population the budget inspires india to spend 229 billion dollars on sports in 2019 20 while united kingdom spends 1.5 billion dollars in 2016 we take pride in taking them in gdp capitalization but we fail to take overtake sporting ambitions of our colonial rulers i hope that minister will look into it and get convince the finance minister to get more funds to the sports ministry it seems that government actively wants the youth side of this ministry to decay to help the cause of certain right wing organizations which wants to occupy this social space national service scheme young leaders program scouts and guides were all made to forward the cause of social social service amongst the other indian youth i was in <coughs> the youth club when my school days finish in 2 minutes sir but youth club is in the it is verge of disappearance in in villages in my district there are around 80 youth clubs only can the minister a young minister who can have a vision for the future of india in each panchayat let us have one youth club which will be funded by 1 lakh rupees per ma- per year which will have a great impact in rural areas i like to suggest and support i like to suggest that these kind of steps which has to be taken in the rural areas to engage the youngsters in the rural level will be the new india which they plan to have it but 21st century india which rajiv gandhi wanted to dream had plans to do that in the in the name of nyks i hope that the minister will reply in his in his reply and accommodate those, those wishes which i want to submit thank you so much sir thank you next speaker is sri bridge bhushan sharan singh please